Yo guys, what's up? Playing killer chess here. Um, gotta keep up my speed. Been focusing on that the last few games. Hope to continue doing so. Yes, I'm a speed demon, as you can tell. Uh, knight f one's a normal move. On oh, d five, most people don't do that. Um. Why don't they do it though? It's like a big mystery to me. I'm just gonna go here. Okay, well, I mean, I was scared of b3. I, I hate when my knight gets stuck over there. It kind of annoys me. Now at least my knight's in b6 and everything is okay. Ah, uh, is that good? I guess I'll take it. I don't know what the hell's going on. Go for that file. <laughs> If he goes a5, I'm just assuming I can put my knight somewhere like. I'll do this. I can go a7, but then it's weak. It's like hard to maneuver from there. But like, a g6 is a normal thing, right? Oh, he wants to put his knight on c4. I guess then I'll have to go bishop b5. Maybe I'll do it now. So when he goes c4, it takes away a square from his knight. That's my big master plan. And now I gotta maneuver my knights somewhere. My knight on c8 sucks. Like usual in the stupid opening. Um, I, I just realized when I played uh, g6, I took away squares from it. That's kind of unfortunate. But okay, I mean, position seems okay. Uh, I'm gonna trade everything. Right now, what do I do with the stupid knight? Let's just go like this. Rook b7, queen b8. Hmm. Um, knight h5 looks like an idea. Bishop h6 might be annoying someday. Can't really tell. Position looks solid. Like, how does he really, really make progress here? Just in case he takes. Pre-move that. Well, he did take. Uh, Alright, what else am I going to do, right? So now, let's see. Some plans. This looks irritating for some reason. No, hold on. Let's go... Hold on. i got to figure out what to do with the stupid-ass knight. I should go for h5, probably. At least make the knight useful somehow. Well, what's his plan here? He has like none. I don't see what he can do really. So I mean f5 and like I am at least doing something. So that's why he's thinking because he knows that like he doesn't have much plan whereas I maybe do. Right, I'm just gonna play it. Because once I take on e4 all my pieces become useful. I'll go knight f6 next move, though. I like my position. I think I'm a little better here, to be quite honest. Uh, pawn takes, I guess. Yeah, I'm very happy with the way things have turned out. So now we got to figure out what to do. I'm going to try to make, I'm gonna try to keep the clock high uh, situation in my favor. Oh, crap, he has... um. All right, well, let's see if I can make this not work. I get the H pawn. I think I want a pawn at least. I'm just going to think because, like, there's a chance that I could, like, force a win somehow. Well, hold on. Knight takes. Oh, I'm just going to do this. <laughs> All right, now I'm going to try to find a good move. I mean, knight of four. Wait. Not knight f4. Um, well, knight d4 is annoying. e4 is annoying. Knight c3 is annoying. e4, he has to move the knight away. And then knight h4. Here goes my time advantage that I love so much. Alright, I think I'm better. At least I'm better here. I don't know. 
at this point, I don't know which one to take with, but I'm, I'm gonna do this one just to, to get some kind of pass pawn going. King e2? No, I'm, I'm gonna go bishop g4 next, that's my big plan. And I win a pawn, we'll see how big of a deal that is. I have two pawns in the middle that look pretty good. He's thinking hard here, thinking hard what to do with his uh, king move. <laughs> I don't know, I would just make a move if I was him. It's probably gonna go, well, knight h4, bishop e7. Okay, this move, it's annoying for reals. Bishop e2 might be the best move here. h6, knight e7, I'm just gonna do this, it's just my instinct, I don't know if it's good. We'll see, we'll see. I mean, d3, d2, d1, right? <laughs> it looks like a, an annoying idea. So that's, that's my big master plan. Bishop a2, then I take on h5. All right, now, if king g7, maybe, okay. I'm, I'm gonna go king h8, because I was scared of knight e6 otherwise, king g7. Bishop g6. He has no real threats. I'm, I'm, I guess I'll go d3 next move. Well, no, he'll go bishop. He'll go knight e4 and stop my pawn. But then I go bishop h6. I feel like he can't stop the pawn. What's his plan now? If if d3, all right. I'm gonna let him figure it out. If bishop f3, bishop h6 look winning. Or maybe I'm wrong, but. Looks damn good to me. Oh, also, bishop takes bishop in e4. It's even easier, I think. Oh, uh, no, it's not easier. It's harder. <laughs> it's... <sighs> hmm. Let's see. Bishop f3, bishop h6, knight f7, king g7. Knight takes h6, bishop f3. I mean, I'm pretty sure I'm winning there. What's the deal here? Can I take and go bishop d2? c5. Hold on. c5, I take. d6. Uh, I get the bishop takes a5. Like c5, take d6. I queen, he takes, I take, he goes d7, I take on a5. And it's just over. This is my plan. Of course, I didn't see c5 idea. Like, it, it could have won, and I would have just been stupid. <laughs> Uh, well, actually, no, because I have e4. He resigns. Even c5, I could go e4, and I'd still win, even if that that idea worked. So, like, like now, I, I could just do this. But I can also I can also queen and bishop a5. So I had multiple ways to do it. But this was a very interesting game, because, I mean, I just told, like, got this dry position and just outplayed the hell out of him. Um, I just... Realize I had to do a plan, like I had to come up with some plan, and f5, because like, all my pieces, like my knight on e7 is crap, I gotta make it do something. And he has no plan. So he just has to sit there and kind of suffer. And once he takes, my pawns are pretty strong, and I think, you know, I may have had a winning move here. Let's see if Houdini finds one. It doesn't, it likes what I did. It says e takes is better for some reason. Yeah, and... Well, it kind of likes h6 better. I mean, I was just a little worried about this. Oh, now bishop e2. But I mean, still thinks he's in big trouble. For, for the most part, it looks like I played this game very well. Happens every now and then. This guy's anonymous, I think, right? Yep. Anyway, thanks guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Peace out.